Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Bachelor Nation News. Married at First Sight and Bachelor alum, Jamie Otis Henner went to social media to share the intense birth story with her new twin boys. As always, she was raw and real with her followers about all that happened during labor. The twins made their debut on September 18. Keep reading to find out more from Jamie. May F as Jamie Otis Henner shares birth of twins. Married at first sight, Jamie Otis Henner went to Instagram to share the intense birth of her twin boys. She shared multiple pictures detailing their entrance. The twins were born on September 18. Hawkins Tyler Henner arrived first at 6.5 p.m. weighing 6 ounces, 4 ounces, followed three minutes later by Huxley James Henner who weighed 6 ounces, 8 ounces. Jamie began her caption by saying, Baby A was born normally. I pushed him out so fast. Baby B was born breech. My spectacular doc reached into my belly, no joke, and pulled him out feet first while I pushed with all my effin might so his head didn't get stuck. She went on to explain the intense moments right after he was born. Jamie said, It was a scary moment at first week he was quite stunned and didn't cry immediately but when he finally kinda came to, and I heard his little squeal, I just lost it. I can't even describe how good it felt to hear them both crying safely in my arms, after all these years praying for them, and then the last nine months praying they'd stick, grow, and be healthy. While the twins faced some issues with blood sugars, overall they were healthy, and did not have to spend any time in the NICU the births did not go as planned. Jamie Otis Henner went on to say that she has a lot more to share with fans. Her labor and delivery did not go exactly as she planned. However, all she wanted was two healthy babies, and healthy her to be able to take care of all four of her kiddos. She did share earlier that she did not progress from 9 centimeters as quickly as she should so the doctor came in and broke her water. The doctors also started her on pitocin to help her get to 10 centimeters quicker. What do you think about Jamie's birth story? She was very glad she didn't have to have a C-section for the second baby. Stay tuned for more updates from Jamie and Doug. She shared Sunday morning that they were all home. 